Oye, Caprons, what's up? All right, um, show them one here. Um, today I'm gonna be talking about something that I hate on Xbox Live, um, which would be ghetto people. Ghetto people on Xbox Live piss me off so much. I mean, like, not really. Just like people that talk with like the like slang ghetto accent, but like the people that are always just a douchebag to you on Xbox Live. Like today, there was someone who was just being a total douche and just yelling into the mic the whole time, and it was really annoying. And he was Mexican or Puerto Rican. I don't know. I'm pretty sure he's Mexican. And every five seconds, he would be like yelling into his mic at us, being like. Oh, you guys are such faggots, oh. And, like, after that, he'd be yelling in Spanish to his mom. And it was so annoying. Like, I don't know if that ever happens to you guys. And he was just being so ghetto, like, Oh, man, I'm a fuck your mama. I fucked your mama last night. I'm like, dude, shut up. Like, that's not funny. Try to be original or something. Like, just people like that. It's so annoying how they just think that they're funny. And... They're not, like, those are probably the people that'll be working at McDonald's for the rest of their life when they're, like, 50 years old. I mean, there's a guy at my local Walmart, he's, like, 55 years old, and he hates his life, and he's, like, a ghetto white guy, and, yeah, he hates his life pretty much because he works at McDonald's and he's a 55-year-old. And, um, that's just the kind of people that those are, and it, it just pisses me off so much when they think that they're, like, cool and everything by, like, bitching you out on Xbox Live and whatever like that is just the most annoying thing to do and if you're one of those people that do that like that does that please knock it off cuz that people just hate that people will hate you for it and people will file reports on you and you know get your Xbox Live account banned or whatever and just, it's just annoying no one likes that but um yeah just ghetto people on Xbox Live that's just annoying um, and next thing I want to talk about, um, just like what I do sometimes, like, well, no, pretty much what I don't do. Um, I'm not really one of those people that play in a party on Xbox Live. Like, if someone invites me to a party, I'll play with them, but I'm not really the kind of person to start a party and, um, you know, like get playing or whatever. I'm just the kind of person, I'll just join a random game, play. A random game or whatever with people that I don't know and that just I just like that a whole lot more than just playing with a party because with a party you know that your team's always gonna be like the same game to game to game but um when you're playing with just a bunch of random people you can pretty much get anything I mean I get kind of pissed off when I'm playing with like shitty people on my team that don't watch my back or whatever but, uh, you know, worst case scenario, you just, uh, you rage quit. I mean, so long as you don't do that too often, it won't ruin your, uh, win-loss record, and you'll be fine. Uh, another thing that I like, though, about not playing with the party is that if your team sucks and their team sucks, you'll get all the kills. Like, if, if your team sucks and you're amazing and their team sucks and, you know you'll just uh you'll end up with like 40 kills in the game the rest of your team will have like two or three or you know like max nine or whatever like nine at the max um yeah so that, that I, that's really just one of the things that I like about not playing with the party and uh you know also you're not like fucked over if someone has to leave all of a sudden like if someone in your party just has to leave and they're uh the party leader, you know, you like leave with all of them and then you're fucked over and the, uh, the game's over for you and that just that just ruins it all, which is why, you know, just play by yourself. It's, it's just more fun. You, you meet a lot more people and you don't just like slave yourself to being good with like that group of people. I mean, when I play with a group of people constantly, I get used to their playing style, so I adjust accordingly. And, um, when, when you're playing with, like, them over and over again, once you're not playing with them anymore, you're kind of screwed because your playing style is so set to be playing with them, and 
once you're not with them, you know, you're kind of just screwed and you can't really do anything anymore. But, um, yeah, I don't really mind it, though. Like, if I'm playing with a group of people, I don't mind it. I'll do it. I'll have a good time. But, um, yeah, I just don't really like playing with a party. It's just not, it's not as fun for me. I don't know about you guys, but just from, from what I've experienced playing with parties, it's just not as fun. Uh, this was a total fail here, but, um, yeah, wait, watch, uh, fail. Um, yeah, but this brings me to the end of the video. Hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, Showman1 signing off. Remember, comment, rate, and subscribe. Peace.